Hey guys, Shifty here, and welcome back to more Pokemon Renegade Platinum Hardcore Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we fought um, this bitch we're traveling with. I don't remember her name because she's not that important, but we fought her, and it was kind of a difficult battle. I can't lie. Uh, we're in Victory Road, and I mean, shit's just getting she's kind of nasty at the moment. So, if that sounds interesting, and you haven't subscribed, consider subscribing. You know, I recently hit 300 subscribers, and now I'm on my way to 300,000. So. I mean, it's really just a small jump from there. Um, I don't have... Sorry, I'm very unprepared. Let's see. Give me just a second. Let's see, Victory Road Trainers. Because I don't know who all is in here. Um, who did we just fight? We fought... I Okay, we fought Nido Queen Metagross, I remember that much. And these are two psychic type trainers. Um, these would have to be Dusclomp, Sableye, Dusk Noir, Chimeco, Frostlass, Wobbuffet. Okay. Well, unfortunately, I have to fight both of these losers because you can't surf on the water when you have someone, when you're escorting someone, which is uh, very stupid and fucked up. However, that's the game we're playing. So I don't know if this is Dusclomp's or Chimeco lead. Um,. I guess I could probably lead with you. And just go from there. Ugh. So which one are you? You're Chimeco, Frostlass, Wobbuffet. Okay. Chimeco. Um, just do a little bit of scouting. Energy Ball, that's fine. Actually did more than I thought because of the crit, and then the spit after drop, which is so fucked up. Um, we can pivot Guard War from one. And by one, I mean exactly one. And then we kill with that. Then Frostlass comes out. I don't want to stay in, actually. I thought about it. I don't want to stay in. Captivate. Lure my special attack. That does not matter. Yeah, does not matter at all. And I need to have Umbreon in against... Uh, or, like, a, whenever Frostlass dies, because last is Wobbuffet, and we all know what Wobbuffet does. Alright, time for a couple of minutes of just toxic stall. Because I am not hitting this thing. Uh, so how's it going, guys? I, uh, I'm recording this very late. It is obviously the day before, because that's when I record all my videos. Except for uh, any collab series. But it is currently 10.10pm. 10 10 uh, the day before this is supposed to go up. So let me know if I got it up on time. Because uh, it... It truly depends on if if I don't have any layout changes, then it's easily on time. If I do have layout changes, then it gets a bit more interesting. Um, no, I think I can just continue leading Umbreon for uh, Dusclops. So yeah, as long as there's no layout changes, no deaths, we should be good. Um, I don't know what this thing is doing. Toxic? Oh, the same thing. Interesting. Hmm, it's times like this, I wish I had Refresh. However, we just gotta kinda stick it out. Rock slide. Interesting. It's gonna pay back again. Alright, we do take a little bit of chip damage. Dusk Noir, I'm still gonna toxic. Those are Phantom Force, okay. Or not Phantom Force, Shadow Force, whatever. Uh, however, I am forced to switch out because I don't want to die to toxic. And it actually does quite a bit of damage, holy shit. Bro, kinda fat. Bro kinda kinda hit different. Counterpoint, we have Oh shit, he goes before me. Or after me, so I still take the damage. Unfortunate. But I mean it is what it is. I mean we have infinite heals right behind us, so it's not like it really matters. And then Sableye is dead as shit. And we're good. That's uh two trainers down. Um Let's see, okay, a little bit of a maze. Nope, because we're right here at the end of it. Okay, um, who was this dude? This is Black Belt Willy, Heracross, Machamp, Top Crook. Oh, you know what we did last time when uh, we had a fighting type, gate, or fighting type guy to fight? We simply led Aerodactyl and Brave Birded. And then the other dude is a Fortress, Kabutops, Dawn fan kind of guy. Interesting. Alright, gets absolutely murdered. 
What's the over-under on Machamp getting murdered? It's 100% actually. And then Toxicroak? Who knows? Okay, fake out. Very funny. Asshole. Fuck that guy. Alright, Fortress Kabutops Dawnfan. Um, I, I'm realizing now I don't have a single Fire-type move. Fire-type or Fire-type move. Hmm. I mean, what's what's Fortress really doing? Because maybe I can just set up on it with uh, with Gyarados. Just D-dance a bunch and then call it a day. Fortress. Let's see. Just get a little D-dance on him. Payback. Okay, that's doing that's doing a bit of damage. D dance again. You can keep going for payback, man. Gyro ball. Okay, interesting. It looks like it doesn't have any status or um, entry hazards it wants to set up. So, should I might as well get plus six? Because uh, I can just like waterfall Kabutops and Dawn Fan. All right, yeah. Um, actually, is Waterfall 100% accurate? It is. Okay, so yeah, this is just... This is free at this point. Kill you. Kill the fuck out of Kabutops. And then Dawnfan. Simple as. Now, if I remember correctly, after we get out of here, there is, like, a, a fight with Dawn. That's like... Let me look at the document. Um... Yeah, level 70. Level 70 rematch with Dawn. Also, are we done with this? We are done with this. Let's fucking go. Alright. Let's get the fuck out of here, then. Did she heal my Pokemon? She healed my Pokemon one last time. Let's see. Um. Yeah, these are all... Okay, so since it's level 70 and there's, like, a couple trainers... There's trainers listed, but I don't know if they're, like, uh, necessarily mandatory. I am simply going to get everyone to level 70. And then pray that I don't have to change my team. Because uh, I don't want to have to edit this, and I also don't know if I, I'm going to have time to edit this. I'll specifically edit the layout, because the layout's what, what takes time. Because I don't, I don't actually do editing for uh, the video itself. Unless I'm cutting something, but usually then I just pause and OBS anyway. Let's see, she's got Alakazam, Mamoswine, Granbull... Oh wait, no, she doesn't have Granbull. She has... Yeah, she's never used a Granbull before. Um, I guess she's using one of the Clefable teams then. Okay, her, her team should be Alakazam, Mamoswine, Clefable, Lopunny, Jolteon, Infernape. That should be should be the team. Let's see, Alakazam lead. I'll have to look at her. I think there's a team breakdown in here. I'd be pissed if there wasn't. Okay, yeah, there is, thank god. But that's neither here nor there, because first we have to get through a couple of trainers, probably. Let's see, who all is here? Who's here? Ace Trainer Ruben should be up first. He looks pretty skippable, though. No, let me, let me grab this item. I am a little slut for items. Upgrade? Wow, something I'll never use ever. And this should be... This should be the Veteran. Excuse me, my good sir. I don't think you turn this way. Okay, there's a black belt. I'm assuming this is Carl. Shout out Carl. One time for the one. Carl Weezer, the goat. Just kind of avoid you here. Let's see. Okay. What's this guy's deal? Okay, he's a spinner. Son of a bitch. Three steps after the repel runs out. Alright, run. Yep. There she is. Okay. Alright. Um, I'm going to pause and try to formulate a, a plot. 
on how to beat this, so I'll be back in a second. And I'm back from my little thinking spell, and I have come to the conclusion that Aerodactyl just wins. It's faster than Alakazam, and because of Brave Bird and uh, Rockhead, I believe is the name of the ability, uh, we don't take Recoil, and then we can uh, get some free damage on the next Pokemon. So that's the plan. Uh, hopefully, hopefully it works. Because Dawn's team is scary as shit. I mean, this is, I think, besides the berry fight right before the Elite Four, this is as strong as, like, a rival gets. So we just Brave Bird, and then this brings in Jolteon, obviously. But because it has a Shukaberry, Earthquake is not going to uh, kill. So the best chance to kill is actually Stone Edge and praying for a crit. Okay, we don't get it. It does get really close, though, on the roll. And then we can just Earthquake... Because it has a full restore, obviously. And then the Earthquake again. Easy peasy. And this is Mamoswine. Uh, Mamoswine is interesting because... Actually, no it's not. No it's not. I'm, I'm seeing the line. I'm seeing the line. Stone Edge. Not the one I wanted to see. I wanted to see Eyes will crash there, but it doesn't matter because Superpower does not kill, actually. Alright, we're good though. Good. Infernape is hippo food. Don't know why I turned off speed up there. Stone Edge does not matter. Non consequential con con consequential damage. There we go. Sorry, I'm like trying to finish this and like hurry and then also you know, try to make good plays and be semi interesting. Um you're getting earthquaked. One ninety four I did like 110 damage, which is fucked. I don't think I live another one. Um, who can I go to? Spitty F. Dagerdos, but of course, of course. Moonblast. It still does a hefty chunk, but it. This probably does eat Moonblast the best out of any Pokemon on my team. Fucking miss the KO. Alright, come on, Gyarados. You can you can do this, buddy. I believe in you. Move last. Okay, as long as we don't get crit, let's fucking go. And then you're dead to Sandstorm. Let's fucking go. Okay. Alright, we're, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. Opony is her last Pokemon, actually. And this is... This is Hippo all day long. And then we protect. And then... I'm just gonna slack off once. Okay, I didn't know if Mega, crit, uh, Mega Kick Crit was going to kill there, but we're looking good. We're looking good. Alright, let's fucking go. This went uh, better than I thought it would, honestly. I was I was expecting to have to sack someone, just because of um, Mamoswine. From what I could gather, uh, just like guessing about the AI and shit, Mamoswine would either go for Stone Edge or Icicle Crash against uh, Aerodactyl. And who, or what it went for, because it's choice banded, uh, so it locks itself in. Uh, who, or what move it, uh, what move it clicked, changed who I was going to go to. For Icicle Crash, it was going to be Gyarados, because like, what else am I going to go to? And if it was Stone Edge, it was going to be Hippo. But obviously, I couldn't really know that. But in the moment, I simply saw the line. I saw the Matrix, and I was like, oh. Neither is the answer. I go Mamoswine. And who could have guessed Mamoswine was the right answer? Unfortunately, Superpower didn't kill, but... I mean, we didn't... We didn't suffer any harm from it. And that fucking Clef. The Clef was the other thing I was so fucking worried about. Because of Calm Mind Softboiled Moonblast. Because uh, I don't really have anything for fairy types. Yeah, you don't... You, you don't do shit. You don't do shit. So I was very worried. Let's see, fuck you. And heal me, please. Please. Now, if I remember correctly, and I think I do, the way to finishing uh, Victory Road is where we came in here, and then we go like across a bridge. I'll know when I see it. Let's see, we came from around here. I'm thinking, no, 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 we were over here. Yeah, I'm remembering now, I'm remembering now. Even though it was, it wasn't too long ago. Effects were off already. That's a hyper potion. I told you guys, I'm, 
like trying to get this done quickly but also like be entertaining okay yeah so i think we go across this which means we have to go down there which means i guess we have to fight this guy um oh, what the fuck does this guy have so this is right before we meet um marley so this is veteran edgar i think in which case uh he leads pz which is a special attacking machine so i'll simply lead my special defense wall and that's how you play pokemon folks let's see pz i am right um i'm just gonna fucking toxic him man we get we get a little toxic stolly out here Let's see, so he's rocking PZ, Tangrowth, Empoleon, Golem, Typhlosion. Interesting team. Moonlight back up to full, because... And bam, we defeated Porygon Z without taking any damage. Kind of. Golem. What is Golem going for here? Can I get the double protect? Okay, no, fuck me. Hammer arm. Okay, does quite a bit of damage, too. Let me just protect for a little bit of leftovers. A little bit of greed. Um, yeah, we can just go hip out on an earthquake, I think. I don't think it matters any. Let's see. Okay, doesn't kill. Unfortunate. And we get crit. Unfortunate. That's, how we, that's why we have slack off. Explosion. I don't think I've ever seen... If I don't want to take that kind of damage from anything, ever. Um, okay, so it's going for Power Whip. Power Whip, uh... Power Whip, strong grass-type move. Physical, which is interesting. Um... We go Gyarados for one. Get the Intimidate. Power Whip does not very much damage, all things considered. And then we start praying for Waterfall Flinches. Stun Spore. Oh, you're actually a bitch for real. Um, then we just start quaking. Quaking like the oats. Okay, man. Really did not need to paralyze me there. We live one, though. And we get paralyzed again. Awesome. I, lo I love Pokemon. Pokemon's a good, fun game. Um, oh, Air Touch just has its Focus Ash, because we didn't, uh, we didn't pop it. We just, uh, I guess we just raw lived the move. Beautiful. And I'm just praying this kills. Thank God. Thank God Air Dactyl's broken. Empoleon comes in. This should be... I mean, this could be fucking any move ever, actually. Flash Cannon, okay. Really would have loved to have Gyarados for this one. Because I'll be honest, I don't think I beat this thing one-on-one. -on -one. Protect us all with the Hydro Pumps. Everyone's just doing a lot of damage. A lot of damage, man. Okay, finally misses one. Prayed for days like this. Uh, we protect. I think it's out of Hydro Pumps. If I'm doing my math right, I believe it is. Now, is there anything I can do here? I don't think so. I mean... Maybe Gardevoir Thunderbolt? Because it is going for Ice Beams. Okay, no, it's still... It, okay, so it's a mix-up between Flash Cannon and Ice Beam, which uh, makes it so much more fucked up and risky. And Drill Peck, okay. Good to know, good to know. Please don't kill me. Thank you, I really appreciate that. Now, don't kill me again. And then one last, please don't kill me. My man. My man. Okay, this is this is very interesting. This is very fucked. I, I'm truly coming to the realization of how fucked up this is. Okay, Typhlosion's last. Um, all my guys are weak. Ammo Swine. It's going for, like, Eruption or something, but I don't have... I don't have a sack. I think Ammo Swine's going to be the sack. Focus Blast, yep. He lived? Hold on, he lived? Um, 
I mean, we gotta go for Earthquake. I mean, I doubt we outspeed. I mean, it is a sixth level difference. All right, I mean, hang on, what, what's the backup plan? When Hippo dies, we just go Aerodactyl and Earthquake. All right, pray for Mammo. Oh my god, my goat. My goat living the Focus Blast into killing with Earthquake. My fucking goat. Oh my god. Oh man. Um. All right, so that means... Hang on. Oh, fucking Mammo the goat. Um, this means this is Dragon Tamer Clinton, which is such a funny name. And... I... Do I have the, uh... Ice Beam... TM, by chance? I don't? Okay, fuck me, I guess. Didn't even want it anyway. That means I have exactly one Pokemon on the nice type move. Um, oh wait, no, I have a fairy type. What am I saying? What am I saying? Yeah, we just, uh, we just simply win. Alright, Flygon lead. Easy. Get blasted. Dead as shit. Aerodactyl. Um, Aerodactyl. Easy. Yeah. Okay. We're looking good. Okay. Lag for absolutely no reason. Very interesting. Very interesting choice for my computer. Uh, we can slack off once. Brave Bird. Honestly doing, like, good damage. Like, for what it is. Beautiful. And then we just Thunderfang. Alright, this is looking good. So he only has Gyarados and Dragonite left. And this should be Gyarados, I'm assuming? Yeah. Now, what's the over-under on Thunderfang killing? Aqua Tail? We eat that. Come on. Come on. Give her a challenge. And then we just protect. And then for the ultimate BM, we just go our own Gyarados. And we D-Dance. Outrage does nothing. Oh my god, that's sad. That was sad outrage damage. I've never seen outrage do so little. And then last is Dragonite, which is kind of fucked. Dragon Rush made up ass move. Uh, we can just go back to Hippo. Do a bit of protecting. Blizzard. Since when did your ass get Blizzard? I mean, if you're gonna go for Blizzard again, be my guest. Misses, beautiful. <laughs> I'm literally just switching and protecting and stalling. And you know what? <laughs> and he just misses. Beautiful. That's just what I wanted to see. And for a little more BM, protect. Pokemon. Pokemon's a really fun game when you're just playing like this. I get why stallers do it. I get why. Like, I see the vision. And this is it? This is it? We're out? Oh my god. Can you believe it? Here we are. We made it. On our second attempt. The first attempt loses to the first gym. The second one makes it to the fucking Pokemon League. Alright, well. I mean, there's literally no better place to end it. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Hope you subscribed. And I guess next Friday we're going to be fighting the Elite Four. And I'm going to have to team build like a son of a bitch. And I might actually do it before uh, an episode, which is a first for me. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, you know, leave a comment, subscribe, like, all the bullshit. And I'll see you guys in the next episode where we fight the Elite Four and probably lose. Peace.